Hello. Hi, this is Colby Sazerac. I'm calling from <laughs> Airlines. I was looking for Adam. <laughs> yeah, that's me. Adam, how are you doing? I'm um, all right. This is just a courtesy call regarding your account. Do you have a few minutes to talk to me? Sure. Is there something wrong? No, no, nothing's wrong at all. Listen, we just noticed that you fly quite a bit, and mm -hmm. noticed that you request frequent upgrades when you're flying with us. Yeah, I do. We do have a new policy, and I have to let you know that in the future, anytime you make an upgrade request, it's going to cost you 10,000 miles. <laughs> what do you mean by that? I mean, any request that you make from this point on is going to charge against your mileage. So you may have a million miles saved up, but if you ask us for an upgrade, it's, you know, it's going to go down 10,000. So what you're saying is I can't even explore the idea, are there seats available? If you do make any action on my account, you're charging me 10,000 a mile. That's what you're telling me. I will point this out right now. You just made a request of me, and I know you didn't mean to. In the future, if you ask me a question, I'm going to answer your question, but I'm also going to charge you 10,000 miles for asking that question of me. Okay, hang on. First of all, you called me, and I want to understand your policy. Mm -hmm. So let's put the miles on the side for a minute. Can we do that? Sir, I regret to inform you that you just did it again. I did what? And again. Uh, you just asked me two questions in a row now. That's going to be 20,000 miles. 20,000 miles for what? and 30,000 miles. That's what we're trying to tell you is every time you make a request of a customer service representative, it's going to cost you 10,000. So when I say for what, that's a request of you? And that would be another question. So you okay. see in, So now that I've spent this supposedly f bullshit 10,000 miles, well, it's are 40 you going to answer my f question? It's 40,000 miles now. I just want to let you okay, know. Okay, whatever the amount, I'll talk to your boss after you're done being a hole. Do you actually answer my f question? Yes. Can I get some service for these miles you're supposedly taking from my account? Hey, you just spent 50,000 miles. I'll be happy to answer your question. All right, then how about you start, fool? What's your question? I've asked you, according to you, five questions already. How about you start answering them? Well, I need to know what they are now because I've forgotten. I was so wrapped up in how you're just spending your miles like crazy. Aren't these, aren't, these, uh, aren't these phone calls recorded for my customer service or whatever the f*** you guys say? Why don't you go back and play the tape so you don't charge me more miles? To answer your question, they are recorded. That will be another 10,000 miles. So we're up to 60,000 miles now. Thank you. I'm glad I could answer so your question. So every time I open my mouth, you're just going to charge my account. Is that what you're doing now because you can't afford all the miles I've spent? I haven't spent enough money with you people. Now you got to f*** me in the a Sir, were you saying that I'm f***ing you in the as a question or a statement? That was a statement, and you're an hole. That's another statement. Okay. I thought you were questioning me, asking if I'd like to do that to you, and I don't. You know what? Forget the miles. F*** the miles. You're a little piece of Now, sir, I think we've gotten to a point in the conversation where I don't know where to go. You're obviously upset, and you don't understand our new policy. Yeah, I'm f***ing upset. I would like to make this better. You would like to what? I'd like to make this better. Yeah, you're going to put the miles back in my account and stop acting like a douchebag? I can't do that, but I can offer you complimentary checked luggage on your next flight. Complimentary checked luggage. That's your solution. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's a fabulous that way. That my 50,000 miles give me checked luggage. That Really? That's, that's your solution? You can check one bag for free on us. One bag for free. So basically, because I don't spend enough money with your company, you couldn't find any other reason why I could use my miles as a thank you gift. You decided to f*** me out of my miles to pretend you were giving me free check luggage. Are you f serious? That's putting it very harshly, sir. That's putting it reality, head. I would like to think of it more as a prank phone call. Yeah, it better be a prank call because you guys are douchebags. Well, it is. And so that's good, at least. What do you mean? This is actually Jubal from Brook and Jubal in the Morning doing a phone tap on you. Are you serious? <laughs> yeah. Your mom, Susan, set you up. <laughs> she says that you fly all the time and you can't stand the airlines. Oh, my God. You have no idea. <laughs> I do want to tell you, though, there is a $35 convenience fee for this prank phone call, okay? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, f*** you. <laughs>